Hello, good day. Andy here with Pop RVs. We're ready for some open road adventure. Full time living capable 2006 Fleetwood Discovery. This is the 39L model. Onan Quiet Diesel, 7.5 kW. You got new headlights on the front, tons of storage total of four slide outs expand the interior space all the slides also have their own shade canopies and then you've got some additional shade on the side windows with its pull out awnings easy access to all your storage whether the slides are open or shut you can hear caterpillars 330 horsepower turbo diesel chugging away nicely Roof access ladder, 10,000 pound tow capacity, beautiful tritone metallic silver and gray exterior, nice shade from the outside canopy, and then you got another awning over the entryway door. Front tires are newer, rear ones are about three years old. Two solar panels are on the roof. There's also a Xantrex 2000 watt inverter charger system. Wonderful interior layout. I like the opposing sofas for entertaining purposes. Power seats for both the passenger and the driver. Mileage is just over 101,000. Leveling jacks, smooth transmission, adjustable wheel, nice Kenwood stereo system. Generator is serviced every 50 hours and it's showing 2564 and a half for its runtime. Power visors and shades. There's outside entertainment with TV and speakers and uh, another TV in main salon area. And then the third one is in the rear bedroom. They've all been updated to smart screens. Airbed sleeper sofa on the driver's side. Pump is included. Got a nice countertop extension and drawers for the kitchen. GE Profile, Space Maker, Microwave, Oven, Regular Oven, and then a three burner stove top, nice four door fridge and freezer with ice maker. Plenty of pantry space as well. And then I love these pull out drawers. Nice and deep, but then it's good use of space for keeping supplies out of the way. Four seat dinette table. Tabletop drops down. You've got the filler cushions for an additional sleeping space for added guests. And then abundant storage all the way around up top. All the headliner looks good. There are a few stains on the forward carpet here where some rain got in with a sideways rainstorm. Uh, could be cleaned. May just want to update it with some new material anyway. There are no current leaks. Moving backward, we've got the midway bathroom. Nice size separate shower stall in it. Skylight for Beautiful natural light in here. And then your sink with storage below as well as behind the mirror. On this side, we've got a combo washer dryer unit, always great to have. No waiting at a park laundry room or laundromat. And then completely separate bathroom space. 
nice natural light and ventilation with the side windows and rooftop fan and then some more storage in here simple foot pedal flush operation on the Dometic toilet and then we've got a privacy door closes off the rear bedroom space and then when someone's wanting to use the bathroom and the whole rear half of the coach this doorway blocks it off so much room in here TV number three in the master bedroom nice Tempur-Pedic mattress nightstands and drink holders on both sides you've got reading lights as well as the sconce lights and then a nice wide double door rear closet space plenty of room back here and I always like that they do a really nice feature with the remote on and off for the generator right next to the bed and your solar controllers back here I don't know if it's bright enough there we go. I got pictures of it on the listing though nice little seating area storage underneath and then a bunch of drawers here again headliner in the rear bedroom looks all good take some time check out all of the high resolution photos we have posted on poprvs.com and give me a call today with any specific questions look forward to meeting you in person for your walkthrough inspection let's get you out on the open road cruising and having a good time